So 49% of organizations draw incorrect conclusions because their data lacks business content. So as an example, let's say the, the data says revenue is $2 million and the customer is Acme Corp and it's the third quarter revenue number. But maybe that particular database row or that particular fragment retrieved by the AI does not specify that the $2 million was a one-time contract, not recurring revenue, and your agents are now inappropriately adding $2 million in ARR to your reporting. What I'm saying is that is not uncommon, and that is a great illustration of how the context really matters when you are trying to construct efficient agentic systems. You have to get context that works. Agents should be able to understand the difference between booking and revenue between gross and net active and churn customers from universal single source definition sources of truth. And if you don't have that, if you don't have a semantic layer that defines the meaning across the top of your data at a high level, then the more data you add without context just means more confidently wrong answers. Engineers deal with this exact same issue. Context makes or breaks everything. For process and mechanical engineers, you need to add to your LLM a couple of documents first and then prompt it. These documents might be things like uploading first, a section of the gas processor's handbook for an oil and gas engineering calculation. Several good report examples, the link to a place on the internet where your audience has left their mark. These are the types of things that our lab at Singularity is investigating and that work for us and our clients, best practices of context engineering.